we'll see different sands for construction application one is m sand and another one is river sand m sand is a manufactured sand it is manufactured by crushing stone in a crusher mill and the fine particles are used for construction in various levels of construction whereas river sand is a natural sand which is extracted from river beds or river banks and this was widely used before the introduction of m sand so we'll discuss the properties of these sands the main thing is density density is nothing but mass or weight divided by volume or in other words density is the relationship between the mass or weight of a substance and how much space it occupies or in other words its volume so keeping this in mind let's see what is the average density of an m sand density is very important when you calculate the uh, cft or tonnage or in kilograms so the average density is 1750 kilograms per cubic meter or m cube one cubic meter is equal to 35.3 cubic feet so it the density of m sand varies somewhere around 1750 or 1700 so for one cubic feet one cft of m sand we need to divide 1750 kilograms divided by 35.3 which works out to 49.5 this varies somewhere around 45 0.5 to 49.5 so for 100 cubic feet of m sands weight we need to multiply it by 100 which works out to 4950 kilograms and further dividing this by thousand that is one ton is equal to 1000 kg so when we divide that it comes to or it uh, narrows down to 4.95 tons that's how you calculate uh, the weight of 100 CFT of uh, M sand or 1 CFT. So in river sand, the same way, the density of river sand is normally lesser than M sand, manufactured sand. So we are taking it as the average density is equal to 1620 kilograms per cubic meter. As we already know, that one cubic meter m cube is equal to 35.3 cubic feet cft so now for one cft cubic feet of river sands weight we will divide it 1620 divided by 35.3 gives you 45.8 kgs so this is the weight for one cubic feet of river sand so further multiplying this with 100 gives you 4580 kilograms this is the weight of 100 cubic feet of river sand and further to calculate in ton you need to divide that by 1000 so it gives you 4.58 tons so here uh, we will calculate the volume of a water sump or a tank to have more clarity for a rectangular or a square shaped tank because this formula works only for even uh, uh, shapes like rectangular or square. Mm -hmm. Let's consider this uh, container or water sump with a length of 7 feet, width of 4 feet and uh, depth of 10 feet. So the volume is length into width into height. So 7 into 4 into 10 respectively gives you 280. This is the actual volume of this container. If any substance is filled in, this is the volume. So in other words, we'll say the volume of this rectangular tank is 280. So to calculate volume in liters, we multiply that with 28, which gives us 7840 liters. When water is filled in this rectangular container of 7 into 1 into 10, 
it will hold 7840 liters of water so why this 28 is being multiplied let's take this container with the inner length of 1 feet inner width of 1 feet and inner height or depth of 1 feet so now this is evenly shaped or it's a square shaped container when we fill in water in this the container will hold 28 liters of water so 1 into 1 into 1 into 28 is equal to 28 so this container will hold 28 liters of water that's why we multiplied by 28 so now we'll go ahead and see how easily we can measure and calculate the cubic feet of sand in a truckload we need to first measure the inner length of the container the trucks container and the inner width of the container and the inner depth or height of the container of the truck so as we know volume is length into width into height so let's substitute let's consider that the inner width of this container is 15 feet the inner width of the container is 7 foot and the height is 5 foot so when you multiply this you would get 525 CFT or cubic feet this is how you need to measure and calculate the truck loads on site when you're receiving or when you purchase M sand or any other sand Thank you for watching. Hope this helps and please do subscribe and share. See you.